Right up with the shot, and it's an absolute screamer. Thank you, a shot at goal. And. Cardo with a chance to play lay on bomb corner, and it's a winner. Joe Cardo with his 100th goal for Kelty Hart. Kids are three points today, and that's League One football secured as well. How are you feeling? Really pleased. Um, obviously, I've, I've touched on it before, you, Sean, in terms of kind of coming to the club as a young manager and still a player. It was, you know, it was a big, a big season for us, um, and we've all been in the division. That's our second year now, so for me to kind of stabilise the club and. You know, look forward. It's I'm really pleased for everyone um, involved at the club. It was tough conditions out there for for a football game today. No, hundred percent. The the wind was kind of a coming side on, so it was it was difficult for both teams. Um, but I think our goal, as as you watched, um, was probably a first time we shoot maybe strong three four passes together, and um, Stefan McCluskey gets up and managed to knock it. And I think the keeper probably did better, but. It was a good goal for your part, um, and then at half time I said to him just keep going, um, and I thought we were great, we had to battle, show a lot of, kind of a character, we had a lot of young lads in the team as well, so it was, as you say, it was a great three points, and you know we just need to push forward now, going at the last three games. Steph's been a very versatile player for you this season, obviously found in at right back, scoring the goal today, what have you, you made of his season? Listen, Steph's been brilliant, um, I had a wee chat with him maybe six, seven weeks ago, and he's kind of a bit frustrated, he's been playing as much. Um, you know, listen, I've known Steph a long time. I played him, I played him at Morton for a few years. He's a good lad, and I told him not just stick with it. And I've put him in at right back, and he's he's honestly he's been he's been excellent for us. Um, with the game in front of him, he drives forward, he defends really well, and you know I think he's really enjoying his football. All the boys are obviously having a wee bit of banter with him, but he's he's been first class, really first class perf performances, and you know he's a leader in the team as well, which I like. Um, and that's one of the reasons why I brought him to the club, brought him to the club, sorry, because he can play different positions and. The last four or five weeks, he's, he's arguably been our best player. Reese had to go off after no long after half time. What was the reason behind that? He's, he's had a wee issue with his knee over the last maybe month or so. Um, so I was kind of a try to manage his load in terms of training sessions. But yeah, um, and then he had a wee bit of a virus during the week as well. But as I say, he's a captain. He's, he's a big player for us, and you know sometimes getting 50, 60 minutes out of him is, is barely getting nothing. So again, we'll manage him. Um, as I say, three games to go. So. Um, he's had a brilliant season as well as as is Bav and Jason and OD and listen other boys have been great CJ I could go through them all you know as a, I'm just really pleased that you know I've secured f League One football and can we now push and, and see how high up the league we can finish and we're off to a stadium you're familiar with next season off to Falkirk next week sorry off to Falkirk um, what are you going to do for that game listen Falkirk the, the best team the best team in the league I'm um, sorry Um and, and they'll want to keep their unbeaten run, I've, I've no doubt about it. But for us, it's we can go and you know just try and do what we've been doing. We've always kind of given them decent enough games here, I know it finished 5-1, but I don't think it was a 5-1 game and then I think it was 1-0. So we'll go there with you know, full focus and try to win the game, and I'm sure they'll be, so it'll make for an interesting game of football. But you know, as I said, I'm just really pleased with the day, really pleased. I think that's us 1-4 in the last five, so you know, I've got a wee, um, wee bit of confidence behind us and you know, we'll go to Falkirk next week and see how we get on. Right, thanks very much. Thank you.